peace be to you. In today's gospel, we reflect the parable of the sower. Jesus saw a big crowd coming to him. He had compassion on them. And he started to preach the gospel sitting on a boat. It was so happened that Jesus could not stand and preach on the plain because of the huge crowd. So he had to preach sitting at a boat in the Sea of Galilee. Jesus has selected a very ordinary example of sowing the seed. This is an ordinary example that every common person could able to understand and the seed, sowing seed was compared to the sowing of the word of God. Jesus had selected four types of grounds that were usual terrain of the Israel community and Israel territory. The first, first one was the roadside and the thorny bush, rocky, rocky place and good soil. So Jesus uses these four types which were common seen by the people to explain about the word of God. The first one was the roadside. It's a plain place, plain surface, unplowed, so the birds have the accessible to that place and take advantage of that. The second one was the rocky ground. It was usual in the terrain. There will be some rocky places with a very thin layer of the soil. The top soil is very, very thin. The seed could fall on this soil Immediately it can get sprout, but unprotected soil make the seed to be burnt of the sunshine. The third place was the thorny bush. Though there was adequate deep soil inside the thorny bush, but there were so many weeds already had grown inside the thorny bush and the word could not grow because it was already enough to choke the sprouts. Finally, the word of God or the seed fell on the good soil. In the good soil itself, there was not much complete hundred percent. But according to the quality of the soil, when we take according to the quality of the soil, it was really hundred percent. So Jesus said this and he invited the hearts of the people to get ready to receive the word of God. When we make ploughed, watered, manoeuvred the arts of the people, the word of God can be sowed, get rooted into that, 
grow well and will give us hundred fold harvest so let us make ourselves the good soil we also ex get explanation for this by the words of jesus himself in the latter gospel passages let us reflect in this words and make ourselves to be a good soil heavenly father we thank and praise you for all the gifts you have showered upon us thank you lord for this beautiful day be with us strengthen us heal us lord for we are your children many a time we make ourselves as thorny rocky and roadside places lord help us to understand the greatness of your word and let it may take deep root in us we ask this through christ our lord amen